Embarking on a refined journey through the annals of history, we spotlight the mystique and splendor of lost golden adornments once gracing the lives of queens, princesses, and noblewomen. This documentary delicately weaves tales of beauty, intrigue, and timeless elegance, focusing on the exquisite, wearable gold treasures that have vanished, leaving behind a legacy as captivating as the women who once wore them. Our narrative begins at number 10 with the Golden Rose Brooch of Versailles, a masterpiece of the jeweler's art from the court of Louis XVI, gifted to Marie Antoinette. This delicate brooch, symbolizing love and secrecy, disappeared during the chaos of the French Revolution, its whereabouts lost to the tides of history. At number 9, we explore the legend of Princess Charlotte's Golden Locket, an heirloom of the British monarchy that vanished in the 19th century. Bearing miniatures of loved ones, this locket was a personal treasure, its loss felt deeply within the royal chambers, echoing the personal tragedies of its last bearer. Moving to 8th place, the golden girdle of the Renaissance maiden tells a tale of beauty and craftsmanship from the Italian Renaissance. Encrusted with pearls and precious stones, this girdle was a symbol of purity and status, lost in the upheaval that swept through Italy during the waning days of the Renaissance. In seventh place, Empress Elizabeth's sunburst tiara, wrought from the finest gold to mimic the rays of the sun, adorned with diamonds to catch the light. A jewel of the Austro-Hungarian Empire, its disappearance mirrors the tragic life of its illustrious owner, vanishing in the turmoil of empire's fall. At number 6, the golden anklet of the Sultana, from the Ottoman Empire, woven with intricate designs and adorned with rubies and emeralds. This piece, embodying the opulence of the Ottoman court, was lost during the empire's decline, its beauty a whispered legend among the halls of the Topkapi Palace. The fifth spot is occupied by the Celtic Queen's Talk, a solid gold neckpiece from ancient Britain, signifying power and divine favor. Lost during the Roman conquest, this talk symbolizes the resistance and resilience of the Celtic people, its disappearance shrouded in the mists of time. Our fourth enigma, the golden fan of the King Princess, a marvel of craftsmanship from the Forbidden City, studded with pearls and crafted with golden spokes. A token of love and artistry, it vanished in the chaos that engulfed China during the 20th century's dawn. At third, the Byzantine noblewoman's golden hairpins, ornate and delicate, these pins were not just adornments but symbols of status and sophistication within the Byzantine court. Lost during the Fourth Crusade, they remain a poignant reminder of a civilization renowned for its love of beauty and learning. The penultimate mystery, at number two, is the Visigothic princess's gold belt buckle, a relic of the Dark Ages, embellished with garnets and intricate filigree work. A testament to the craftsmanship of a bygone era, it disappeared as the Visigothic kingdom fell, taking with it the secrets of its creation. And at the apex of our search, at number one, the golden diadem of the lost matriarch, from an ancient civilization that predated the Greeks. This diadem, a circle of pure gold, designed to crown a woman of power and influence, vanished without trace or record, its loss an enduring mystery that tantalizes historians and treasure seekers alike. Through these captivating stories of lost golden treasures, our documentary pays homage to the unbreakable connection between history's illustrious women and their love for exquisite adornments. As we trace the lineage of these vanished items, we not only celebrate their former splendor but also reflect on the transient nature of beauty and power, immortalized in the golden legacy they've left behind.